This is the moment a Russian strike hit a line of people queuing for humanitarian aid. Six people died. One day on, there's four more deaths and three injured in a similar strike outside this clinic. The crater the strike left is small. Shrapnel and ball bearings shatter the windows, leaving bullet-like holes. It's alleged that Russia is using cluster munitions. A few hundred meters away, we found evidence they are, right outside a school. This rocket still in the ground. I was inside. I was in school. The shelling has started. I could see through the window it was all red. It was going on for about 10 minutes. When I came out, you see that cluster exploded down there on the pavement. A lot of shrapnel hit the building, smashed the windows of the school. I don't know where it came from. I was inside. That's where the bomb exploded. There's no military in this area. It's residential. One of the impacts was here, right in the middle of the children's playground. And you can see the damage that's been done across this children's play area. I can see it on the wood, on the stairs, but also look what it's done to the metal on this slide. It's cut straight through. Now, no children were hurt, but this could have been fatal. We found these small pieces of metal scattered and lodged into the play space. Lethal shrapnel that has no place in a residential area, let alone in a children's playground. Asad Beg, Al Jazeera, Kharkiv.